Of course, they are playing uh, good football, high intensity, top of the league in Sweden now. Uh, I see a lot of potential in the team, so I just want to give it a go and try to do my best and hopefully we can achieve good things here in Ellsberg. Yeah, of course, I've noticed a few games. Uh, of course, there are two Icelandic players here, Sven and Haukon. Uh, they are my good friends. Uh, so th the team has been playing good, getting the results. I've seen they have a good fans. They are all into it. So hopefully I can give some joy and some good results also to the fans and also to the club. I, I know them, I've played with them in the under-21 national team uh, and I've talked with them about Elsborg and just life so they are, they are funny guys and good friends. Uh, they have a young team also, to, they like to de develop uh, players. Um, like this year they have been really good, getting good results. Uh, everybody is really focused and everybody around the club is top. Uh, it's like a family, so I'm really excited to be part of it. You are uh, quite young, uh, but already been playing in Italy, Netherlands and, and uh, Denmark. Uh, tell us shortly about your journey. Yeah, uh, I went to Italy when I was uh, 17 years old to Bologna. Uh, I started first there in under 17, but I played like th four games and then I was moved up to the uh, second team like Primavera and I was there for nearly one year. Then I was moved up to the first team, got a lot of trainings there and I got my debut uh, in 2020. Uh, when I was 18 years old and uh, that was crazy uh, and after that it came like I think I played 15 games for the first team there um, that was crazy experience uh, a lot of uh, dreams came through there and then I went to Copenhagen uh, on loan I was struggling with a lot of injuries there. Uh, I couldn't get the rhythm and the playing time I was hoping for. And then I went back to Bologna and did uh, another loan in uh, Nijmegen in Holland. And after that, I, I turned back to Bologna and did preseason there. And now I'm here in Ellsborg. Hopefully I can uh, get a lot of playing minutes and show how good I am in football. Yeah, it's it's a huge step, exactly when I came there in the beginning, nobody spoke English. So it was really hard for me to be alone there and uh, nobody I can talk to. So I had to learn the language quick, uh, but I, I did that. And uh, of course, playing against all these big players and uh, be part of it, uh, it's just like being in a video game. But you uh, get used to it and uh, you, you don't think about that, you just think about playing good and be professional and get better every day. So I think you learn also a lot training with a good players and uh, for me it was a really good experience and uh, I've learned a lot and uh, it was good in the like, bank to, to uh, get this, um, like uh, have done this in the past. now. I know how, how, how it is in the highest level and uh, I know how to work and I know how to, to be there. So it's a lot of work you have to put in and in the end you get rewarded. Did you got uh, Mihailovic as a yeah. coach? Yeah. He gave me the first games and all my time in Bologna he was the coach. Huh? So I was crazy coach, so good mentality. He taught us really how to be a winners, and uh, he was like a big name, and uh, it was I really appreciate all what he has done for me, and of course he got uh, cancer, and in the end uh, he died, so that was really shocking. But yeah, it was it was really good time with him. Yeah, um, I got my first a national team game against Belgium when they was the best team in the world. I was marking Kevin De Bruyne the whole game. 
that was challenging but a really good experience and uh, I enjoyed it a lot and um, after that I, I got I think nine or ten games so that was really good and uh, a lot of experience to play in the highest level with the national team. Uh, the last year I've been not playing so much with the uh, uh, club so I play with the under 21 to get minutes and that's also really really good uh, level and good to have uh, games there and you improve as a player also so that's it's good. Describe you as a player. Uh, I'm a midfielder uh, I can be box to box or defensive midfielder. Uh, I can run a lot. I'm technical on the ball. Uh, good passes. Uh, I win duels. So I will say just overall good midfielder. I see it's a lot of work we have to do. Uh, it's it's not finished. We have to push ourselves until the last game. No matter how many points we are ahead or. Just uh, one game, uh, one game at a time, and we have to improve every day in training, in games. We have to be really focused. We we can't lose focus for one second. Uh, we have to push each other in training every day, and in the end, if everybody works hard and we play as a team, I don't see other uh, outcome than being champions. Welcome to Elfsborg. Thank you.